Hello everybody and welcome back to an episode of Nuclear Throne Ultra. We are back again. I am on my new PC now as well, so things are going to run even smoother than prior. Uh, I don't know who I want to play today. I haven't played as the business hog yet. Bosses drop gold weapon chests. Hold for shop. Let's give this let's give this hog a go and let's take a look at what our skins are. Reach and beat the throne using only golden weapons. Okay, that's not too bad. Successfully use the investment ultra. Okay. Okay, sounds interesting. Let's jump in. So we do start with a golden weapon. Um, it seems to be a golden bullet gun. Um, I do. I am realizing that my volume is pretty high right now, so I'll... Uh, I know it doesn't look like it's very high, but for you guys, it, it sounds like it might be. So I've turned it down a little bit. Let me guys, let me know how that does for you guys, and we'll, we'll sort of go from there. Um, we got a thingy here. Nice. So right click. Ooh, okay. Oh, we can buy for rads. Ooh, I like this. I like this. So this is really cool. Okay, so I, I don't think I want to be using the shop much early on, but as we get later on, it seems like it's going to be more and more important. I'm, I'm down for this. I'm down for this. Also, I'm wondering if the weapons that get dropped, the golden weapons that get dropped by bosses become golden weapons that we can start with or not. I'm, I'm assuming so. I do like the fact this is our starting weapon, though. It's a very good starting weapon. Nice. Projectile speed's probably pretty good on this bad boy. Cool. Okay. We are good to go. Ooh, there's, there's now um, color coding on things. Oh, that's really nice. 20% uh, discount, pretty good. Yeah, let's let's take that and see if we can like use this elsewhere. Let's um, grab a weapon mod. Hmm? How exactly do I... Oh, it spawned next to me. I thought I'd just add it straight to our weapon. Okay. Okay, and that's pretty nice. So we can level up a little bit slower for the exchange of getting a nice additional bit of power early on. I really like that. I really like that. That's very, very nice. I have to say, I'm on a new monitor, a new PC, and the walls here, like this color slightly flickering for me, and I'm not entirely sure why. Um, it's a little bit distracting. Okay, why is that hand closed? I didn't use that weapon mod. It wasn't like that in the last stage, I don't think. Holy shit. There you go, golden bouncer SMG. It does indeed, it does indeed unlock it as a golden weapon. So this guy's going to have hella golden weapons. Of course, we're going to try and do uh, grab investment ultra and grab the um, golden weapon mod. Sorry, the golden weapons only thing. Because the thing is, we're going to get higher and higher tier golden weapons as we go, right? Um, let's go with that. And let's go with that. I really like the color coding. It does just seem to be that the walls are very, very slightly flickering. I don't know if that's showing up on uh, on YouTube, on, on OBS, but it's kind of distracting. I'm not quite sure what that's about. That must be something to do with my monitor's... Uh, my refresh rate's the same, so it can't be that. It must be something to do with my monitor's colours. I'll see if I can fix that, but I don't think there's anything that the developer can particularly uh, sort out for me. Nice. I think the Bouncer SMG is probably the best thing for us right now. <laughs> Bouncer weapons are pretty darn good. Pretty darn good indeed. We probably want to get um, back muscles. Just so we can start holding a little bit more of this, uh, this ammo. Close that. Beautiful stuff. That is it. Okay. I wasn't sure. Um, impact wrists is always good fun. In fact, so good fun that it just kind of kills some stuff right off the bat there. Not even sure how or why. 
Them explosions sound chunky. Have they, have, they, have they changed the sound of those explosions, or is that just me not having played this game in a little while? I'm still going to change, uh, lower the volume a little bit. Still seems louder than normal. I can't remember how much health this guy has. Okay, not enough, clearly. Golden disc gun, I don't think we'll want to take. That seems a little bit disky risky. Ooh, I do need to maybe up my brightness a little bit as well. It's so all this stuff with working with a new um, new PC. So it's okay for now. We're fine. It's okay for now. I'm not quite sure what sort of the better weapon to use here. I'm trying to make sure that I have enough ammo to get through all this. Nice. I feel like it's all going very well so far. Beautiful stuff. Um, we'll take Rhino Skin here. Oh, a big Kraken Gun would be really nice right about now. This might be a stage where we struggle a little bit. So I don't think this thing does a hell of a lot of damage. No, oh, no, we did it. We did it. Nothing too bad. We got a golden weapon through there as well. Golden Bazooka. Now that is the sort of weapon we're looking for as like a, a powerhouse weapon. Because that's going to help us on our boss and all that good jazz. It's nice to have. It's also going to help us on some slightly more tricky enemies. And Little Hunter and the like. Good, good. Get all those rads. Oh, I'm not. I know I'm not using my shop right now, uh, but I, I genuinely think for right now we kind of want to ignore the shop. Make sure we get as high rank as we can before we get to the boss to give ourselves the best chance of doing this golden challenge. I want to try and unlock all of the alt skins if plausible. Um, what would we want next? I think I just bashed my mic a little bit there. I apologize. I love just being able to throw all these shots out there. Lovely stuff. Lovely stuff. Try and take those out. Yeah, we're, we're doing just fine here. My god, we've not managed to fill a single one of these crown vaults up so far. We've been getting kind of unlucky in that regard. Um, second stomach is good. We'll go with Euphoria here. I think that could be quite useful. Nothing around here. Yeah, it's like slightly flickering. Okay, well this has already gone bad. I've missed both of my rockets so far. Okay, we got him. Took a bit of doom, but we got him. And um, we got the Jaw Splitter. Jaw Splitter's pretty good. Also, this character is quite fun with, um... Gonna be quite fun with the randomized golden weapon. I imagine this character was a little a little more dull before the randomized golden weapon. Now, you can have so many golden weapons to randomize between that this character's gonna be uh, quite, quite different each time you play it, I reckon. It's quite fun. I like that. We're doing good so far. Everything's been going reasonably well. I think Golden SMG was a really good one to get early. It's not crazy strong in terms of damage output, but it's pretty consistent. And obviously it makes it easier to hit things. I goddamn hate these, these spooky boys. Get out of here, you. You rapscallions. I'm going to need some more ammo. I'm noticing these bigger enemies. Oh, that was very bad hit by me there. Some of these... Sort of stronger enemies are taking quite a few hits to go down. So ammo is becoming a bit of a nuisance. We're getting there though, but I think this, this next boss on this area is going to be a little tricky. Oh, 
These fucking bats, man. They're so annoying. Cool. At least we got um, this bashing enemies around. Knocking enemies all over the place. You can see, ammo's not looking good right now. And we've just come across the big boy. I mean, luckily we have this thing to save us. Maybe we want to take the Jawbreaker at this point. Yeah, let's take the Jawbreaker at this point. I think it's going to be better for us. Um, ooh, so this has changed now. 10% reload on all weapons. Whenever you reload a weapon, roll for a chance to slap the resources out of nearby enemies. Chance depends on base reload. Let's give that a go. Nice. Oh, there's that slap there. I kind of like that. That's cool. Oh, dude, that's a really nice visual effect on that. And it's it's got some range on it, too. Okay. It's a little little spicy, but we're doing okay. I really like this resource slap. This seems like it's gonna be really good. I don't know if it I don't know if the slap does damage as well, but I'd assume it does a bit of damage. Oh wow! Wow! Okay, we've got a killed by thing here, what which is nice. Um okay. So we can change our starting golden weapon now at least, which is good. Uh, probably go with the jaw splitter, right? Right. Okay. Because now we can go into a... Um, a bolt marrow build. With this thing. I think that's pretty useful for us. Unfortunate there, we got so close, but... Big boys, big boys do big damage. Tis always the case. Good thing as well is we can spend some of our resources to actually buff this thing up a little bit. If I, in fact, if I do it now, if I come over here and, uh, do weapon mod. That's weapon drop, god damn it. Do you know what? Let's, uh, let's, let's do a restart. Let's try and restart so we get a half decent mod. If we're going to be doing this and carrying this weapon the whole way through, we really want to make sure we can make it work. And w the only way we're going to be able to make it work is if we get some weapon mods on this thing that actually put it in a really good place. Not enough rads yet. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, you... We got Kraken as well. You absolute dickbag. But I like this idea, though. Right, get away from that for now. Uh, excuse me? That's not what I pressed at all. Oh, it's wherever you let go. You don't have to click it. Okay, that's that's slightly unintuitive, I've got to say. Uh, we got some interesting weapon here. What the hell's this? The drum. That's new. Patches be adding all sorts of new weapons recently. Right. So I just let go on here, and it should spawn a weapon mod. We get swarm. Good stuff. Okay. Good stuff so far. Good stuff so far. We leveled up as well. Get out of here, you guys. Cool. Almost got enough for another one. Um... <clears throat> Puffy cheek seems good right now. Right, is that enough? Yes, it is. Projectile speed. 
like the way the boss spawned directly on top of that for me. Toxic Revolver. Might as well take it as a secondary. Yeah, I'm probably going to stay kind of low level towards the start here while I uh, build this up. Good, good. Explosive is very good. Okay, so we've got good ones so far. We, we obviously want to get rid of projectile speed, though, because I just don't think that's going to matter too much. Or I could just kill myself with explosive. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Oops. I didn't realize that explosion would kill you in a single hit, to be honest. I didn't know it would do that much damage. Blood is good, I think. Destroys projectiles at least. That's something. But I think this is the way to go. I think this is the way to go. Good, good. And like I said, it seems to be working thus far. It's going to be a little bit hard to get things started. But we'll get there, we'll get there. We're just hoping for bolt marrow, obviously. We need that early. Ooh, this is dip. This is definitely new. Okay, let's see what we've got going on here. Obviously, we've got alien intestines, which is kind of interesting. But this is new. Replace three health with one armor. Whenever you are missing armor, reduce your reload time by 35%. Enemies have a chance to drop armor. Very interesting. I, th I believe armor blocks one instance of damage. So if you get hit, it just it just takes away armor. Um, No matter how much damage was dealt. Which is pretty useful. Not enough rads yet. Excuse me, not enough rads? Dude. Oh, I leveled up, that's why. God damn it. Golden grenade revolver. Um, Eagle eyes is good with this for right now. Okay, those guys. That's a lot of those dudes. This 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 plan that I've got in mind, it's seeming like it's not going to work so far, but it will. It will. We'll get there eventually. Not enough rads, really. It would be nice if there was like a percent meter near this with this character or something. I don't know, just some indication of how close you are. Swarm again, that's good. Maybe I ought to go for Bolt Marrow first, rather than going for mods first. I don't know. But yeah, it'd be nice to see some sort of indicator for what percent you're on. Shotgun's good. I like this. Do you, know what, do you know what should be one of the unlocks for this character's alternate skins, rather than what it currently is? Reach, um... Like, loop... Get get to loop without, um... Ooh, I'll take the shotgun as well. Get to loop without leveling up. Just constantly spending your rads. <laughs> Although I don't even know if that's possible, because technically, like, if when you kill the throne, it'll just uh, give you too many rads at once, right? Right, um, Eagle Eyes again. Really good with this weapon. Just means that both shots hit directly in the middle. Frost, okay. I think we're set. Honestly, these are three really, really good mods right now. Frost is just really good defensively. Obviously, Swarm is just nice extra damage, and um, Shotgun is also very nice extra damage that synergizes well with Shotgun Shoulders. So I'd say we got a pretty good setup right about now. Okay. So now it's all about trying to get Bolt Marrow. Oh, that guy didn't die. 
So it's bolt marrow and survivability that we need now. After that, things will surely get easier. Hyper rifle this early, wow. I wish I could take that. <clears throat> uh, rhino skin, survivability. Good, good. A little bit risky there, but we got through it. And see, like, the group killing potential is really good here. Give me all that. We're already up to level 4 as well, so it's not set us back that much, spending all that resource. It's put us in a pretty good place, actually. Just need some extra HP here, because uh, a little bit low. Bolt marrow, there it is. Don't even care what the rest of the stuff is. This is going to make a big difference for us, I would think. Don't like the fact that that guy's behind the boss and I can't really do much about it. Okay, cool. Make sure we got ammo here. Fuck you, goddammit. Golden assault rifle, lovely. Um, tough shell for survivability, yes please. Got a little bit less damage on those dudes, obviously. Okay, this is this is going well. This is going well. Explosive boy. And all of y'all dead. Easy. Oh, there's another one scurrying around over here. Luckily bolt marrow means we don't really need to aim anymore. It's lovely. Cross crashes, kind of interesting. Don't know how sort of smoothly this is gonna go. Seems to be going okay so far. There you go. Just about got through that. Don't know what golden weapon we got here. Golden screwdriver, of course. Not bad. I think we're fairly set. I would very much like to get um, strong arm, whatever it's called, so that we can carry more ammo to make sure we're sort of ready for the boss. So at the minute, I don't think we could do the boss with just the ammo we have, which is why I picked up the shotgun. Now, remember, we can buy ammo, so if we do get really stuck... We do have a way out, but it's not ideal, obviously. Okay. Um, duh, 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 duh. Probably take that, yeah. Okay, take care of these guys back here first. I'm loving the freezing. Should use the shotgun a little bit more, because we do have um, eagle eyes, which makes the shotgun significantly better. Especially at range.
Oh wait, is it just closing it like that, not open it? Okay, right. which sounds stupid when I say it, I realize. It's fine. Didn't want to go through that there anyways. See you over there, you lump. A little bit risky. We got there. Okay. Basic enemies were absolutely ripping through right now, so that's fine. This guy shouldn't be too bad either with Herming. Especially when we just blew up a car on him. He's taking a good few shots though. Not too bad. Blood Rifle is lovely to get as well. I could add a new mod to my uh, Golden Shotgun right now. Cool. More ammo. Okay, this is sort of when we've reached the bit that I'd consider these weapons not being very effective in. What'd be nice if, if, if we got the one that makes your uh, weapon mods even more effective. That would be useful. Power craving, is it called? Nice. Got you. Level 7 as well. We are, like, killing crowds of enemies super easily, though. Almost one-shotting these guys. In fact, we are one-shotting some of them. And we got one more geezer. Chilling around up here somewhere. There you go. Good stuff. Okay. I guess go with Strong Spirit is just a bit of a backup option. Very bad hit on my part there. Thought that guy was dead. We got Big Boy coming in any second now, so let's maybe use our shotgun until he spawns in. I think he spawns after a certain amount of enemies killed. Yeah, he does. Let's get out of here while we can. Oh, that's a new attack. There you go. I just wanted to get off the webbing there. Okay. Little bit risky there, but we, we got through it. Do we want to take the Slugger here? Slugger obviously does more single target damage, so maybe... It's obviously not amazing, but it's two shotting these guys. That's that's good for me. Cube boy can stay away. Three shots the cubes. It's a little bit overwhelming right now, but not impossible. Is that it? Apparently not. Apparently one of them escaped up here some, at some point. I see you there, good sir. Okay. Got level 8 as well. Um, trigger fingers? Okay, no, we want power craving. Okay, so... Every weapon has one random mod. Increase maximum mods by one. Increase the effectiveness. That's the big thing. The increased effectiveness means that... When we use this bad boy, the mods on it will be more effective. It also means we can add an additional mod onto it as well. Which is pretty nice, although we would have to sacrifice XP for that. Okay, we're getting through this okay. Of course, it's not ideal, but that was a good hit, sir. That was a good hit. Did not like how close he got, but I'd like to get more ammo for my uh, thingy, but I 
Cool, you got that open at least. May have screwed myself here a little bit. Okay, now I'm good. Get out of here, you. Shouldn't have hit me there. Nice. Okay. Not happy with our ammo situation at all, or really even our health, but it is what it is. So I can take Splinter on this as a fourth mod, right? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Exit. Okay. Right, so we've got golden weapons here. This this should give us an unlock if we can not get killed here, which, eh, don't know how it's... One second. Okay, apologies. I am back. That was a inopportune time to get a phone call, but let's see how this goes. Uh, yeah, I'm not particularly happy with that ammo situation, so it's probably going to be a pretty rough um, fight, but we'll see. It would be nice to have melee, realistically. But yeah, I think as long as we can sort of ride the wave out, stay the course, this shouldn't be too bad. These are the things we want to be getting near to get our ammo, but... Oh, bollocks. Okay, no, we're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, that, that somehow worked out. I played that very risky, and it somehow worked out. Hey, we did it. Awesome. Now we've got to try and grab the Investment Ultra. Golden Wrench unlocked for Business Hog. Nice. Okay, so what do we want to go for here? Probably Trigger Fingers, just knowing that we're going for um, looping. Now we just got to actually get through this and try and loop. I'm taking this just so we've got a way of... Uh, Gaining ourselves ammo and stuff. Saving ourselves from the more horrible parts of this boss fight. It's taking a lot of damage though, I gotta say, it should be fairly quick. Good stuff. Right, bullet shotgun there. Okay, good old... Good old van coming in. I love the way that, that you can kill all the enemies before they even get out of the van. Okay, good stuff. This this should be fairly easy to get ultra as long as we can survive this stage. But we got um, strong spirit and all that lots all that sort of stuff, so it shouldn't be too bad to do. Here we go. So now we can get our ultra. What was it called? It was investment, wasn't it? Let's have a look. So we've got prosperity, which is enemies drop more rads. Bosses drop ultra chests instead of gold chests. More shop items. Kind of interesting. Um, investment. There it is. Let's see what the other one does. Gold digger. Significant increase. Um, significantly increase gold and weapon reload speeds. Ooh. And gain nothing now. If you reach loop two, you can choose two random ultras. Doesn't include things you can't use. Okay, so basically we take this and now we have to make it to Ultra, which... Uh, we'll have to make it to Loop 2, sorry. Which I'm uh, a little bit iffy on, I'll be honest. A um, little bit iffy on. If we can get a better secondary weapon, I'll be I'll be A-OK, -okay, because we no longer need to have it gold. It no longer needs to be gold, so we can pick up a better secondary weapon now. And that'll do us pretty well, I imagine. But survival? Eh, we'll see. We'll see. I've done it before, but not exactly easy. Don't think I want a mini rocket launcher shotgun, considering I have no explosive protection. Okay, nice and easy. Ooh. Golden Nuke Launcher there. First character we've got that unlocked for. The Bubbler. Nah, I'm, I'm, I'm looking for something that's really going to be like... I want like a Kraken Launcher or something. Something that's going to be absolutely amazing for uh, looping. Which, there isn't a ton of weapons like that just readily available. But there is quite a few if you get lucky. And we do have to deal with Mumma, or whatever her name is. Mother. Mum. 
I can't remember her name. It's something mum related. Oh, I've got to remember as well. I can actually, um, I can actually shop pretty, pretty efficiently nowadays. Ow. I don't even know what's going on back there now. Right, what else can I get on my shop? Okay, let's let's grab one of these chests and see if we can get something good. Explosive mopper, a beam shotgun. Eh. That could be good. We'll see that. We'll see what that's like. Eh. Not as good as I was hoping. I was I was thinking that explosions would kind of like spread all over the goddamn place. Okay, let's let's take it slow here. Ah, I always forget about this prick. Okay, we did get him. Nice. Explosive crossbow. Could be good. This thing's still better with all the mods we've got on it, though. Okay, keep our distance here. Dude, golden car? Golden car has a lot of health. Chunky blade gun. Oh my god. Wait, does the blade... Does that blade hurt us? Because if so, if it doesn't, that's really good. But I don't want to test the theory, really. <laughs> don't really want to test the theory. But yeah, let's, let's grab a bunch of these chests whenever we can. Health dispenser swarm gun. Could be good. Super splinter gun. Let's try the swarm gun for a bit. It's not that good. Again, not not that good. And to deal with some not so great weapons here. I mean, this thing's still doing great, which is really nice. Be able to stick with this weapon from the from the get go, and it working this effectively is a surprise to me, for sure, but a welcome one. Inverted portal there, mini rocket shotgun. Bullet wall, big missile launcher. Try the bullet wall for now, I guess. What the hell's left? Ah, oh, it's you, I see. God damn it. Give bullet wall a go for now. Go with frost, I guess. Probably frost. Through we go. Okay. Oh, it's you. I've been wondering where that fire's coming from. There's another one of them down here somewhere. Let's go kind of around. Make it a little easier on our side. There he is. They're not too bad, those guys. It's like Stupple Short Pop Gun. Seems kind of interesting. So yet again, another sniper behind this guy. Holy shit, that's a lot of missiles, good guy. Good golly gosh, indeed. Okay, where do we go? Okay, so if we want to, if we want to absolutely blitz a boss down, that's gonna be our way to do it. I don't know how I'm still alive right now.
Okay, that thing just smashes through ammo like it's nothing. That was... I don't even know how I lived. That was intense. That thing is not really a viable weapon, realistically. Excuse me, turret. I think I killed you. I don't even know what I picked up there. Shouldn't have used it. It seemed to be something explosive and horrible. Explosive blade gun. Oh my god, I almost killed myself with that thing. Bouncer laser rifle. We've had something like this before. It's pretty good. God damn. Okay, this thing did very good work against this guy. Oh my good god. <sighs> Give me HP, game! What's with all this ammo business? I know I need ammo, but HP is much more important right now. Okay, I'm getting a bit concerned now. The game is just not giving me health at all. What the fuck is that? <laughs> Super nuke launcher, goddamn. Okay. The electro weapons seem good. Again, the the health spawns are pretty abysmal right now. What's this here? Energy shank gun. Isn't the shank gun really goddamn good? If I remember correctly, is it better than? Nah, the electro gun's better, I think, than that. The shank gun is good for protection, though. I guess it will destroy shots. What the fucking shit is that? You see that? What the hell's this bouncing thing? I've literally never seen this in my life. Again, game. I require HP. <laughs> I require lots of HP. Uh, let's let's see if we can get ourselves some extra stuff here. We don't want that. I mean, that would be maybe kind of good, but I'm too close to sort of take that risk right now. We've at least got the uh, assassin, yeah. What the heck? Um, and then do we want a crown? Probably. Probably take this one. Weapon drops give one armor instead of giving ammo. Yeah. Get out of here, you. God damn it. Having a hard time here. Dude. Dude, no! He died on me. Fuck's sake. Anyways, we'll leave it there. That was a fun character, but getting that other skin's gonna be rough. Let's uh, let's take a look at what the skin we unlocked is, because uh, I'm not exactly sure. That is... That's some rough stuff. We unlocked so many golden weapons. <laughs> is that Donald fucking Trump as a pig? That's pretty funny. Anyways. Ah, difficult stuff. Hope you guys did enjoy that one, and I'll see you guys in the next one.